So you want to stand straight. Mm -hmm. Big smile. We've got the X and Y axis here, so we can see that the horizontal line is parallel with her eyes, and that the vertical is right in the midline. And then Ashley's got the, the Z. Red. Yep, the Z. The Z axis, which mm -hmm. hers is kind of. Is this. Yeah, that's how her. The bubble is right in the middle, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, which means that it's parallel with the floor. And so wow. that is how, uh, that's the angle that her maxilla makes with the true parallel with the floor. Okay. Your Z-axis is like this. Yeah, my left side sits mm -hmm. far down. And I probably oh, I should have pressed a little bit, a bit further up to get more prominent marks on her right side. But then how we clean that is, these are just one-time use, so we just disconnect that. And we send that to the lab, and then we disinfect, we wipe the whole thing here. And that's it. Okay, so then the lab would have this platform, and they're gonna position this inside. And when they've got the model, this one's already mounted, but when they have the model, they'll put that as it fits and mount the case accordingly, like that. So this gives them the relationship between the upper jaw and upper occlusion relative to the parallel. And that change in the angle is, um, <clears throat> Uh, is is presented here in the blue bite.